Thank you. I see you're here for the first time, aren't you? You need the chief. He usually comes on his own. But if you really need him, I'll help you. You have to find the magical paint first, though. I can't get it, because it's under protection from book characters. The librarian always hides it from us, so we don't call him for no reason. I'm sure the bucket's somewhere nearby. Here, you'll need this to find it. Thank you. 
Thank you for calling me, Tom. I got carried away with business in other places. Some people are born to be wanderers. Those who travel to fictional worlds. I'm sure there have been times when you were so absorbed in a book that the story seemed like reality. You're lucky. That's the first sign that someone's ready to become a wanderer. And I can help you do it. Unfortunately, some people misuse this ability. They thoughtlessly change book plots, which could lead to the merging of worlds and total chaos. Only the initials, the first letters of all books stored inside the stories, can stop them. I sense that someone has tampered with the correct order, and something horrible is about to happen. Unfortunately, I only store books. I don't have the power to change their plots and protect the heroes, so you will have to take this on. This is the Wanderer's Amulet. Only you can use it to pass through the thin veil between worlds and return. Good luck, Megan. I should go. I bet Becky's sad without her headband. But I'm sure we'll meet again. Like, in my dreams. Ahem! Who are you? If Mr. Rochester sees you, things will go badly for both of us. I'm Jane Eyre, and I recently took on the position of governess for the young miss. I don't want to be scolded because of a stranger, so either prove you can be here, or leave. If Miss Charlotte sent you, that's perfectly all right. However, you're going to give everyone quite a shock wearing an outfit like that. Take this. It's only a dress, but I'm sure you can figure out what's missing. Come back when you have everything. Everything. 